A while back, I posted a numeral wordle puzzle, and today I will be explaining the solution in detail. At the end of this video, I'll also show you how this problem connects to other wordle variants and regular wordle to help you become a better player in general. If you want to give the puzzle a go first, click the original video in the top right. And if you have no idea what numeral is, I'll also link the video where I explain the rules there. Our goal is to find the optimal next guess in this numeral grid. But let's first talk about what it means for a guess to be optimal. You might have heard about the word salad being the best opening guess in normal Wordle. So what makes this word the best? In Wordle, your primary objective is to solve the game within 6 tries and your secondary objective is to minimize the number of guesses needed to get to the solution. When played by a computer, the opening word salad wins 100% of the time and has the lowest possible average score, also called the expected score. Going back to our numeral game, we should first try to find all possible remaining solutions. With only digits 1, 6, and 7 in the number, and no digit 1 in the second position, these are the 6 solutions that remain. Since we're currently on guess 3 in the numeral game, maybe there's a 4th guess we can make that would guarantee we would find the solution on the 5th guess. This 4th guess should exist. And why you should think this is reasonable is that you can get a maximum of a whopping 475 different numeral colorings with a single guess. Each of the five digits can be one of three colors, green, yellow, or gray, and we'll also know if the guess will be more or less than the solution. However, if the guess is all greens, then the higher or lower counter will display as equal instead, so we overcount by one here. Also, having four greens and a yellow is impossible, so we remove the 5 times 2 ways in which that can happen. With these 475 colorings, we just have to make sure our 6 solutions each has a unique coloring. It turns out there are multiple numbers you can input as your 4th guess to always solve the game in 5, and you don't even need the higher or lower counter. As a side puzzle, pause the video right now if you want to find a number that fits that description. So one possible answer is 76716. The second digit is either 6 or 7, so the first 6 in this guess will tell you which one it is. And you can also see that this guess helps you deduce what the fourth digit is as well. This shows that the fourth guess gives each of the remaining solutions its own coloring, so we get a score of 5 across the board. And each of the remaining solutions has a 1 in 6 chance to be the actual solution, so the expected score is also 5. So let's play this one out. And we get it in 5 as predicted. So, is this an optimal next guess? The answer is no, partly because the video is far from over. You see, the only way we can achieve a lower expected score is if we guess a possible solution as our fourth guess. So this is clearly an improvement, because now we have a chance to get the number in 4, unlike our previous number, which got all solutions in exactly 5. Alright, let's find the special number. As a heartfelt thank you to all of you for 100 subscribers, I'm also going to be turning on the camera and revealing my hands. I'm going to be drawing out the results of guessing each of the 6 remaining solutions against themselves, which will tell us which guess puts each number in its own coloring. For convenience, I've only listed the 2nd and the 4th digit of each number here but you can check that you would get the same conclusion if you laid out all five digits. In the end, we can see that the only second and fourth digit combo that guarantees a win by the fifth guess is 7-6. With a 1 out of 6 chance of getting the solution in 4, our new expected score is about 4.83. This means the optimal next guess in our game is 17766. So how does this apply to your strategy in normal Wordle and the majority of its variants? Well, you can write out all remaining words and try to spread them across the color configurations as evenly as possible. But what if it's early in the game and there are many words left? Or you can't just methodically write out the solutions like a numeral since you don't have the answer list in the back of your head. You can still pick a good sample of the words or have a general sense of the letter distribution. This likely isn't new information for you. You're probably already aiming to guess the common letters based on what words are remaining, and you might also prefer to place letters in their most likely positions to maximize the information you gain. For example, most good openers with a C in them, like crane or trace, place a C in either the first or the fourth position, 
This is because the seat is in one of those two positions a large majority of the time. If you open with trace and the C becomes yellow, you're going to be pretty confident the C is in the first spot, and you don't have to spend your next guess trying another C position. If you assume C is now at the front, you might guess an L or even an H if you think those are now some common second letters. However, having good positioning is usually secondary to guessing common letters, and occasionally the positioning may not matter that much. This is typically the case with the letter Y, since if it turns yellow in one of the first four spots, you're pretty sure it'll still be at the end. Another disclaimer, if you've seen the Wordle video by 3 blue one brown you know that the most even splitting words are not necessarily the best openers, but they will still be great guesses nonetheless. I've actually been re-watching my original video and how I played my repeatal game, where every guess has to contain a duplicate letter. It turns out, attic is not a very good guess here, as it has an expected score of 3.29. I encourage you to determine what the best guess actually is, starting with finding the 7 remaining solutions. Six of these words are common, but one is relatively obscure and enraged some Twitter users three months ago on Wordle number 398. I will be responding to comments to let you know if you've gotten the correct seven words, and the first comment with the optimal next guess and correctly describing why will be pinned. And congratulations to this user for solving the numeral puzzle. At the end of the day, Wordle is a fun word game and you can take it as seriously as you'd like. Yet the more you play, the more patterns you will begin to realize building your own inner intuition to become better at the game and in any other puzzles you may play in the future.